This. The stock market is lower, but we're looking for opportunities. Power Lunch is back at the New York Stock Exchange today. All right, it could be a marriage made in online heaven. TiVo is hooking up with Netflix to stream movies and TV shows. Joining us now with a CNBC exclusive, TiVo CEO Tom Rogers. He got snagged by our Julia Borston with an exclusive. Thanks, Julia. So, Tom, why don't you start us off and tell us basically how the service will work and how soon will it start? First, I have to say, always great to be back to my alma mater. Uh, <laughs> this, this is a... Uh, this is a great arrangement for the consumer. This has been something that we've been asked about for, oh, four or five years. When are TiVo and Netflix going to hook up? Uh, and uh, the timing couldn't be better, I think, given the economy for the consumer. Uh, this is a service that hopefully will uh, be offered to uh, customers in December. And uh, what it means is that if you are a, a Netflix subscriber and a TiVo subscriber, you'll have access to 12,000 movies from Netflix right to your television set for no additional charge. And as we see people increasingly thinking about how do they spend their time at home in home entertainment as people tighten their belts and think about saving money and not going out as much, we think this is a, uh, a great offering for the Times. Now, Tom, TiVo has made a number of new partnerships recently, giving your subscribers access to movies and TV shows from Amazon, videos from YouTube, and music from Real Network's Rhapsody. With all these new partnerships, what is TiVo's new strategy? Well, our strategy is still to be the best way to record television, menu it, organize it, the stuff that TiVo invented and pioneered, we, uh, we think is a great offering for the consumer. But we've gone beyond that, and instead of just looking at TiVo as a way to record what's already on TV, we've turned it into what we think is a, a dream machine. Get anything you want, whenever you want it, whether it's on traditional TV or not. And uh, when you add up all those partnerships you've mentioned and more, there's some five million pieces of content now of movies, TV shows, songs, videos that you can get right to your TV set and whether and and not have to record so it's a recorder and it's a retriever and get anything you want whenever you want it now how important do you see that sort of video on demand type capability being for TiVo and will these deals pay off from a profitability perspective well it's all for about growing subscribers for us and the more subscribers we have the more profitable we are uh, we've been EBITDA positive for the last four quarters. We're on our way to our first uh, EBITDA positive uh, full year. And we think for an awful lot of people who uh, have a lot of options on television, but when they turn on the TV, what they want to watch isn't necessarily on, not only to give this kind of breadth of choice, but to do what TiVo's always been known for, searching in a way that's highly personal so you get what you want when you want it is really what people are going to be looking for in a sea of what is increasingly becoming infinite choice. Okay, hey, Tom, you know, I really thought the cable boxes, the DVR is going to put you out of business and you've reached out to them too and started selling your interface to cable boxes. That's a good idea. But as long as this Netflix deal is such a great thing, why don't you guys just do a full merger? A, f a full merger? Yeah, with why don't you and Netflix, TiVo and Netflix, merge together and form one company? Oh, Dennis, you always got the great questions, I tell you. Well, <laughs> I, I, I came on to talk about a product, not about uh, mergers and acquisitions, and you knew I wouldn't answer a question like that anyway, but um, I think that there's a, an awful lot of opportunity for us to continue to ally with great brand names. We uh, announced an uh, alliance with BlackBerry last month, in addition to cable and Comcast, uh, we announced last month a new DirecTV alignment, which will be a, a whole new product, TiVo DirecTV offering coming out next year. So our view is just continue to build strategic relationships with all the major players in the media world. And with that, we will have a better product than anybody else has out there. Got you. All right. Nice job. Great job, Julia. Thanks a lot, guys. Bill? And for, in case you're wondering what he meant, for nice come back mater. home. Yeah. He uh, used to run NBC Cable. He was in charge of NBC Cable when CNBC was started logos right. many years was, ago and hired us. So. He was our boss, and we miss him. Time. He's a terrific he, guy. He's a good guy. Real deal maker there, trying to get TiVo turned around.